Greg, I really appreciate you coming out and showing me how to do some recording with this. I've recorded a few times with acoustic guitar, but there's just so many options, I don't really know what to do. Well, I've got three new ones. So this is one of the three ways. So this first way, I've got the right side of the room to record them in the stereo pair. The right side of the microphone, you know, they're the equal distant, equidistant to the guitar. The right microphone is on the 12th fret, right here. Mm -hmm. And the left microphone is between the bridge and the hole. Somewhere around there. I mean, you can vary it a little bit for okay. the sound. This is the first way. And I want you to play a little bit, and I'm going to record a little bit this way and show you what it sounds like. All right, cool. Okay, Chris, here's the second way, and this is going to look kind of strange if you're not used to this one. This is the same microphones, type of everything, you know, it's the same microphones, but this is still pointed at the 12th fret when you're going to play. This one, the left microphone, is over your right shoulder, and it's pointed down right at where the other microphone was pointed, kind of right at the, the uh, curve in the guitar, somewhere between the, the, the hole and the fret. Everybody's got conflicting opinions, whether it's more toward here or toward there. But that's the, that's the way it's done there. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to have you play a little bit, and we're going to get a sample of that recording. Okay, Sound cool. good? Yeah. Okay, Chris, last but not least, uh, the third possibility of recording your acoustic guitar. This is just typical where the uh, capsules are crossed. This is the XY pattern. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, the capsules are crossed. It's an XY configuration. This is the uh, right and left microphone. And um, they're crossed like this so the waves don't cancel each other out. Mm -hmm. um, and basically, uh, you set them like this at uh, 90 degrees, uh, and away you go. A few questions: Does it matter which one's on top or which one's on the bottom? Nope. Just as long as the this is just as long as they're in that position. And are they touching each other? Nope. Barely away from each other. I don't know. I mean, I imagine it wouldn't matter if the mics touched a little mm -hmm. bit. Uh, what you don't want is the mics separated from each other, where the the pickup patterns can can get in each other's way. That's what you don't want. And are they pointing in any specific part of the guitar like the other two were? Or? Not as much, no. Okay. That's just pointing in this entire area. Mm -hmm. So this picks up actually more of the entire guitar spectrum. Gotcha. Uh, so, um, and I'm not a guitar expert, but you know, this uh, this will give you a good sound, I guarantee you. Cool. So let's, let's try this one and uh, then you choose which one you like best. Awesome. All right. Play this for you, and you tell me what you think. What do you think? That sounds really good. Right. Well, if you have need some more mic advice, give me a call. Will do, man. Thanks.